What is going on guys, Not Far From Gaming here, and we are back once again playing some more Clash Royale. And today guys, I'm going to be showing you a really good Royal Giant deck, and before you just absolutely flame me in the comment section, let me just tell you something. Every single deck that you use in Clash Royale, someone's going to be upset with, and I was upset with the Royal Giant, I've said it before, Royal Giant is not allowed on my channel, and kind of um, grew away from that. Um, and before you guys start flaming me and everything, and telling me, oh, go wash your hands because you're a dirty player, well, I came prepared. One second. I got my gloves, so now I can't get dirty. Um, oh, I can, I can still move the screen too. That's awesome because I was hoping that would happen. Uh, just gotta touch really hard now. Um, but yeah, guys, I'm gonna be showing you a really good Royal Giant deck that I've been doing absolutely crazy with. Um, I almost won a tournament. I got second. I, I got gypped at the last second. The kid battled. I should have got first, took home first prize. Um, and no, it wasn't a 100 gem tournament. It was a 500 gem tournament. And I've actually been doing pretty good in like 2,000 gem tournaments and 10k tourneys. Um, I usually sit around like the top 50 the entire time. I was actually in first place. I'll show you guys a screenshot for like a long time. For like 20 minutes, I was in first place. And I took an L, and that was pretty much the end of it. Didn't really want to play after that because I knew I wasn't going to come back. Um, but yeah guys, let's go ahead and hop into a replay. Alright guys, that took a lot longer than I thought to be able to press that button. So I don't know how I'm feeling about this in a live match, but I'm going to stay true. I can't get my hands dirty. These got to stay on. So we're actually going up against another dirty Royal Giant player. And I feel bad saying that because I'm using it too. And I'm showing you guys no hate against the card, honestly. No matter what deck you use, you're going to get hate. People say, oh, you're using the next bow. And now it's like one of the top decks in the world. Um, oh, you're using the Lava Hound, oh, you're using the Graveyard, well, you know, you gotta use something, so we're gonna start off with the uh, Electro Wizard, and he's gonna Fireball, and I was like, oh my gosh, his Fireball is like a level 9 or something, takes that out really quick, he's only got a level 9 Royal Giant, which is really weird, but we're gonna get to the tower just a little bit, and um, he does pretty well right there with the Executioner, taking it out, and we're gonna go ahead and log this at the very last second, So there we go, not even going to get a hit though, and um, we're kind of even right now, and we haven't even dropped our Royal Giant, which is good. He's going to drop his, we're going to drop ours, and I was like, oh my gosh, if he has the Inferno Tower, I might be screwed. Wait a second, I got the Electro Wizard. So I'm going to go ahead and drop that down, get an easy, easy, um, like almost a free tower completely, because the Electro Wizard absolutely wrecks with this deck. Um, if you don't have it... It's kind of hard to counter, honestly. And we destroy this Royal Giant before he crosses the bridge. Like, I think he gets one shot off. Yeah, look at that. He gets one shot off. But if you don't have the Electro Wizard, try replacing it with the Musketeer or maybe the Bomber or Ice Wizard. Something around there. But Musketeer is probably your best bet, especially with the Lava Hoon. Lava Loon. That's going on right now. Um, so that left tower is done. We can completely ignore it. He's got a friend on his side, and usually I have about five spectators now. I didn't have a single fan this game, and I was like, are you kidding me? How am I supposed to do this now? So luckily he missed the fireball right there on the Electro Wizard. We're able to take this out, which is minimal damage. We can go ahead and log his tower now. Um, but I think the Electro Wizard finishes it up. Yeah, look at that. He switches targets, hits the tower and the archer. So at this point, all I have to do is defend. And um, that's pretty much a good game. He's going to he's gonna think I'm going on the other side with the Ice Wizard. Not going to happen. We're going to absolutely destroy this. Look, doesn't get a hit yet. I don't even think he gets a hit. Doesn't even touch the tower. He's going to laugh, guys. This is this brought, out, this brought out the inner Royal Giant user in me, and I just started going off on him. Ready? He's laughing. I'm giving him a thumbs up. I'm laughing. Boom, right there. There it is. Thanks. He's laughing again. I don't know why. He's going to fireball over there. He's the one that's losing trophies, not me. I'm not sure why he's laughing. I'm going to go ahead and rocket his King Tower, giving him a thumbs up. This is just crazy, guys. You can say I'm BMing right now, but technically he was first. I'm going to log that low tower, guys, and that's going to be a good game. We're going to hop into a live match and try to play with these on because um, I don't want to catch anything, you know? So currently, we're actually... Look at all those Ws. So currently, we're actually, uh, I think, 8-1. and one. Yeah. So hopefully this goes well. I've been playing people. That guy was like his highest was like 4600. So I'm not playing, you know, like 2300 or like 2900. I'm playing people around my range. The only reason I like playing this is because my card levels aren't the highest um, compared to a lot of other people that I play against. So it kind of 
is a very big disadvantage to me. Basically what I was trying to say is that their card levels are a lot higher than mine. Uh, but he's gonna go with the Executioner. Let's go ahead and try to tap the screen. There we go, no card selected. That You guys are gonna see that message so many times. Oh man, he said oops. Does he have the the rock, the, ro the Sparky or something? Um, or was he just oopsing me? Oh, he's got the balloon, all right. If he goes Lava Hound, that might be a little bit of trouble, but if not, I think we'll be able to handle it. And it looks like it's gonna be that. So we can go like this. I could have just Electro Wizard that down, but um, psych nah. I probably could have left that alone, but definitely trying to be safe. Look at that. Oh, give him the thumbs up. Let's go. Electro Wizard's gonna tank right there, guys. Oh my gosh. Or the. We're getting so much damage. And we got a spectator watching. Who's he for? I don't know. Let's go ahead and drop the minions because we do have to take that Electro Wizard out eventually. Hopefully we can take him out a little bit before so we can get a little bit more uh, Royal, Dam Royal Giant damage. Take that tower out, hopefully. Looks like it's not going to happen. Oh, just kidding. It's going to happen because we're going to log. So he's going to go ahead and drop the P.E.K.K.A. And just so you guys know, I'm still using the gloves. And um, this is really hard to play because especially now that he's going to have the balloon and I got to place this perfect rocket. Oh, boy. Let's go like that. We'll go like this. Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Come on. Oh, he almost got another hit off. Oh, geez. That was close. Let's go roll the giant right in front. There we go. He's going to put his skeleton army down, most likely. Come on. I can't even see because his glove's too big. I can't even see. I'm just going to move it back. Oh, well. All right. All right. He's going with that. That's all right. Let's go. Let's go knight in his face right here. Let's try to rocket this balloon without missing. And uh, we'll Ice Spirit. Oh, just kidding. It's going to go down. Uh, we'll go ahead and Electro Wizard this for no reason at all. And guys, 17 seconds left. We have three spectators going. Let's get this uh, W real quick. We're going to put that down. We're going to log right there. Guys, I'm still using these gloves. You have no idea how hard it is because there is a little bit of room um, left on the fingertip part. And um, it, it's very hard to be precise. So I'm kind of like tapping like that. Um, but yeah, guys, that was a crazy game right there with my Royal Giant gloves on. There we go. We are now 9-1 with that deck on Classic Challenge right there. Um, but anyways, guys, here it is once again. And um, if you guys want your own pair of Royal Giant gloves, go to like Dollar Store or Walmart or something. I don't know. Um, so that you guys can use the card too. But if you guys did enjoy, make sure you hit that like button. It means a lot to me. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you guys in the next one. We got a low battery. Peace.